Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of It's Jenkins. This episode of It's Jenkins is brought to you by Hybrid TSM QS. Throw things far with Hybrid Triple Strength Myomar. Uh, last episode was pretty smooth. We didn't do too, too much. Uh, between episodes I got the mechs repaired. I did do one minor, minor, one minor change to the Valkyrie. Now, what I did do is, like I said I was going to do, is I pulled out the three um, uh, light jump jets, the quick sell jump jets. And I replaced those with a heat sink. I had to take a little bit of armor off the back um, and a little bit off the center torso, not much. So like, like what? Four, nine points or something like that. I, I said 12, it's ended up being nine because of the particular type of ferro we have. Now we do have generally low armor because of the ferro. I wanted to go ahead and do this, which we can't do. So we need one extra slot. I wanted to put the regular ferro on then we have to lose some weight, and I don't know what to lose. So I can't really do that. Um, eventually we'll do it, but I, right now I just don't have the, the, the GAC to be able to do this. So, I mean, we could... So that's too large chem. The medium chem is putting out how much heat? Four. 0.75, and this is a half ton of ammo. So 0.125. I mean, I guess I could replace that with a medium laser. We're already at 12. Yeah, it'd be a little bit... You're doing how much damage? 20? 25, 5 variable. Mm. I don't think there's anything I want to drop in here. I mean, I could put an exchanger in. Can't put the compact actuator in because we'll lose accuracy. But yeah, I changed out the pirate um, sensors with advanced jammer. It's just slightly better than the pirate uh, sensors. And I added a uh, fire control system standard clan to the to the here because we didn't have one before. So we got another plus one gunnery for the pilot here. So that's a little better. I mean, this is marginally better than what it was. The heat seeking is just slightly better. This says 28, 27. I mean, we really have 33 heat sinking, and we're doing 12, um, 24, 28. So not exactly. There's got to be something that's actually increasing my heat generation. I'm not sure what it is because I can't see here what it would possibly be. Unless it's the probe king. Yeah, plus six heat per turn. I mean, we could switch switch out the Pro King with, like... Now, the Omni Jammer's... Omni Jammer... Uh, the Omni Jammer is great for a solo frontline mech because it's got a persistent ECM. So it jams everything within 150 meters by two, including allies. So you want to use this when you're, like... You've got a, a mech that's just out on his own, right? We don't have any more... Uh, Warfare Sweet QSs, so I can't get that involved, unfortunately. So yeah, the Pharaoh's just going to have to sit sit tight, I think, for now. I mean, I guess I could pull out the speedy leg, leg actuator. It's adding 10% walking distance, though. Ooh, do I do that? That's a possibility. We could take that out, and then... Because we're gaining a, a, t a bunch of armor. Like we're five percent armor back, right? And then we could go something like that. Somewhere there. Tell you what, let's try that and see how that works out. Like even five percent armor, I know it's not it's not much. When, you, when you're looking at this here, right, it's like not even five points, right, because five points is 10%. It's like two and a half points of armor across the board here. It's like everywhere. Like this is like three and a half. This is like one point whatever. But it all adds up, right? So, 
uh, yeah, let's just go this route and see how, how it works out. On it. I know it's moving away from the quick sell stuff, I, I get that, but still, at this low level, I would rather have the most amount of armor I can possibly have. Alright, so, uh, that being said, let's go to the command center. I know what we want to take command. today. So, I want to pump up our difficulty slightly. So, we've got two missions I had a toss-up between. And one mission, if we had better pilots, I would definitely go for it, which is this one. Um, so, it's a one-skull challenge mission. They got... Uh, High-end mechs uh, kitted out with gear, right? And it looks like they've got some good pilots as well, right? Some specialists. So at one skull, we're probably going to get wrecked. As much as I like to say it might be a fair fight, our pilots just, it's its our pilots, right? If we had better pilots, I would probably try it. But right now, I'm not going to go that right. But I am going to try a one and a half skull here. It's just hunting down... Um, uh, forces, uh, harrying transportation. So it's like... Just old mech, old mechs and stuff. So I'm hoping to find some quick sell stuff here. The price is right. It's one and a half skulls. It could be something good. I don't know. It's it's still a little bit more challenging than that what I think we should be taking. But we're gonna grab it anyway because it really is the only other thing we can take. And then I think we just stick with what we have here. Um, yeah, we'll just go this route and this to see how we do. Yeah, I think we're okay. Command interface initiated. Alright, we found them right out in the open, right up on that hill. So, if they get reinforcements, they'll be from here. Most likely there's no reinforcements. So, I think we want to start... We could start behind them. I've done that before. Just to change things up. Or we could start across the, the uh, way here. You know what? I don't think I've ever played this one where we started over here. So, let's do that. We'll just start on this side. It's good cover. I mean, we get some cover from this, too. Find out what we're up against here. What do we got? Blackjack. So, Scrap. Ooh, Centurion A. Wavern. It looks like it's damaged, though. So, the Centurion A's got an LRM-10. I think it's AC-10 LRM-10. All right, there's got to be somebody else up there, too. All right, big text. Let's get up here. See if we can spot whoever that is. All right, this should be a good fight, I think. Another standard mechs, but... Uh, the Wavering, I think, is like... Isn't that Comstar tech? Orders. We had that in our la one of our last series. So that's not bad. Uh, position. I think, yeah, we're going to leave it on incendiary because of being on a hot planet. We might as well just try and crank up some heat here if we can. LRM-10, SRM-6, large, medium. For our large and small. Here it comes. Alright, pull out of nothing. It didn't hit. No. Yeah. No, it didn't. Okay, let's get you up here. Acknowledge. Still haven't spotted who the other person would be. I think they're supposed to be, like, up here somewhere? Ready for orders. There might not be a fourth. Spread out a little bit. Keep I the infernos on. So Metal did gain one point of gunnery last episode. There's a bonus. I'm receiving you. Oh yeah, Jenkins, I, I did manage to get, uh, a few episodes back, I forgot to mention it. Did manage to get my, uh... Uh, control bursts. I took that one because I figured a lot of the quick sell stuff has got recoil in that. Confirmed. Control bursts helps drop recoil and, re and reduce jamming. So I'm really hoping that that is going to pay off in the long run. Ready for orders. I gotta. I, I know. I did. I um. I gotta check here in a second. On it. I think I may have respent. Did I respend his points? Because I was going to get rid of the. Uh, I don't think I did. I was going to respend Jenkins' points because I want to get rid of the um, bonus evasion. Because it's not going to come into play later on. It's 500,000 for that, so I'm kind of holding off. 
I don't know what I would go with though. Probably tactics. Okay. Reporting minimal damage. So I'd probably go. Yeah, I probably go the the, the tactics right on that one. Can we get? Can't get on the blackjack without shooting the rest of these guys. So. Blackjack's not in a position to retaliate, so let's go after this no, Wavern here. It. Is it the Wavern I'm targeting here? No, it's the Centurion. Take a shot at this guy. Ooh! That's gotta hurt. That was a head hit. Oh, man. Nice shot. I think he's a, you think he's happy he got that uh, clan cockpit. Or, sorry, the clan fire control system. Oh, damn, retaliation. Got not open my mouth. Yeah, that was a head hit. That was a juicy head hit and a torso hit. What do you need? So this guy is what? Standard probably AC AC two's medium lasers. Bugging out. So, I mean, overheating them is not going to do too much, but I do want to get this fire truck in closer. Because I want to go after that waiver, and the waiver I know will overheat for sure. Uh, let's crank these up to five. Hopefully, hopefully we get a head hit here. Targeting for an alpha All right, everything landed. He's toasty. That's nice. Orders. All right, big techs. Let's get on the same guy. On the move. Full speed. I've trashed all my blackjack parts. I'm not keeping them. Cannot stand the blackjack. All right, let's fire these guys. Your medium's really low in chance to hit here. Roger. I think that's the head weapon, though. I await your command. All right, Jenkins. Understood. Moving fast. Jam and protect our guys at the same time. <laughs> Let's fire this guy. All, all right, a little bit of damage. Standing by. Okay, Arcelor Metal. Hightailing it. Trying to spread out a little bit here if I can. Still nobody else up there. There might only be three of them. All right, we'll we'll use Inferno on this guy. Perfect. He's already nice and hot. We might as well make him. Commander. Ridiculously hot. Kind of like me. Got ridiculously it. hot. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that was bad. Alright, let's just hammer the Wavering again. Hopefully we hit. Roger. Nope. Missed. Can't wait till your gunnery is 10. Well, that guy's in trouble. Yeah, it may only be just the three of them. Ooh, nice shot. That must have been an arm shot. Arm or a leg. That guy's dangerous. This guy, on the other hand, probably going to overheat himself. Oh, they got somebody else. There it is. Is that, is that an assassin? Wait, what is that? Not an assassin. It's a mech. Chameleon. Okay. I'm your spaniel. I can't remember if we have chameleon parts or not. We need to engage these guys up Double on the hill, back. though. Blackjack is an easy kill for somebody else. Hmm. I think we take a shot at this guy. Try and strip some armor. Alright, a little bit of damage. Little bit of damage. Yep. Get it on. All right, buddy. That guy down there is shut down. Let's move. 
Let's move in for a kill shot here, see if we can get a back shot on him. Now, as much as I hate these mechs... You know what, let's just CT. Let's just CT him. Because even if I kill the torso, I gotta kill the engine anyway. That's right. I'm on stay. Okay, we penned. In multiple places. Receiving you. Ooh, that's a back shot too. We'll Understood. take that. Moving fast. We'll take that shot. See if we can core him. Firing on rear arm. Well, we got the one side anyway. Scored a critical hit. Not bailing out, huh? Commander. All right, you. Oof. So, I'm trying to remember where our weapons are here. Oh, both arms. I got two in the. I got two in that other arm. Oh shit, I turned the wrong way. God damn it. Well. Locked on. We are off. Damn it. Mech destroyed. Yes, Commander. Take the side aye, shot. Aye. Better chance to hit against the chameleon. See if we can actually get it though. 35, it's not bad. 27 on you. 29 on you. Uh, you got a lot of energy. Let's go, yeah. Okay, we got two hits. 20 heats, good. We got the fire truck still. Yep. I need to get you down there. Uh, let's go this way. All right, full speed. I want you facing the front. We could come up the side, but... If you come this way, right, they, got, they have a opportunity to get side shots. If I come this way, they generally don't, so... Alright. Hit them hard now. Right, let's see who goes... They all go first, probably. Oh, except for the Wavern. Okay, good thing you didn't get the Torah box. Yeah, I forgot. XL exclamation mark. Fuck. Right. Damn. I learned my lesson. Did I really, though? We'll find out next match, probably. Waiting for orders. Serious mistake, though. All right. It's my left-right thing. I thought I was turning the proper side, but I wasn't. All right, let's see if we can take this torso out. Or the arm, I mean, sorry. We gotta get rid of his AC. Waiting for orders. Like that. Roger. Like that. Yep. And I'm gonna put the. Mm. No, we don't have enough for damage wise to use. Well, yeah, let's use that. I might as well. Get as much in on him as I can. Critical hit, Commander. Okay, that was I'm good damage. He's unsteady now, which opens him up. He opens himself up to a lot of damage. Oof! That was a CT hit. The shot, buddy. Barely hit, Commander. Yes, Commander. Going full okay, let's get up here. That's pretty good on this guy. We'll take that. Hopefully we don't miss. Locking on target. There goes the leg. Nice. Streaks on. Kill. Beautiful. Kill Enemy secured, baby. Lost. Kill secured. Standing by. Let's move to there. You're gonna blow by this guy and go after the waiver next turn, but let's hit let's heat this guy up if we can. Machine guns on, firing. Here we go. 
Nice. Ready for orders. Okay, you don't need to move. 35. 48. Let's go after this guy with the infernos. Or incendiary, I mean. All weapons are go. Okay, landed two. Beautiful. I'm here. Twenty-seven, huh? Much as I want to go after that other guy to kill him, he's overheating pretty badly. So he's not that much of a threat. I mean, he could still fire everything, but... Ooh, that's nice. Ooh, that's nice. Attacking from position. Okay, two flamers on. Ooh, that helps. Standing by. Get up to here. We're going to drop some heat here. I'm going to pull off you, switch around to that, and make this guy nice and toasty. I'm out of SRN. It's all right. We're going to clean this up you. now. We are going to clean this up. Hammer this guy. Got it, Commander. Full alpha. Nice. Target's taking a critical hit. Receiving you. This is our primary target now. Okay, more heat. Beautiful. Orders. Let's get around to here. Double time. Let's go. We're going to switch up to incendiaries on this one, I think. Yeah, beautiful. Firing. I copy. Yeah, we got him. Game over for them anyway. I'm ready. Can I get a solid blue? I cannot, so we'll take the purple. Location confirmed. Let's just give it to this guy. Another full alpha, beautiful. Scored a critical hit. I'm not getting much salvage off this mission, but that's fine. Aye, aye. Better than dying. Ooh, that's nice. Roger that. Ooh, that's nice. Maybe we can overheat this waiver and force him to bail. And he's already shut down. Let's go after his head. Aye, aye. Move to there. Everything on. Going for the headshot. Oh, shit. We went to his back. I will go CT, it's fine. Copy that. Scored a critical hit. Ready for orders. That was just instinctual. This will probably be the end of this guy. We got the time. Let's do this. Try with the streaks. Failed to connect. Nope. Well, we dropped our heat. Good to go. It's the most important thing. Okay, headshot. We get a head hit. Oh, he's out cold. We must have. Commander. All right, Jenkins. Knowledge to approach time for one. 34, huh? Let's go this route. Firing. Okay, there goes the leg. 
knocked down. Let's see bales. Beautiful. There you go. Not bad. Mission successful. Yeah, if I hadn't turned that Valkyrie the wrong direction. Ah, that was my fault. I mean, at least it's easy to repair. I just don't have the, the chem stuff to replace. I think I've got another large chem laser. No, I don't. I gotta rethink the build on this guy. Makes me wish I kept that, or did we get that streak six from the mission a couple of episodes ago? I can't remember. So we got three wavering parts. 45 tonner. SRM6, multi-track. Is there anything else that's good here? Not really. Let's just grab the wavering parts. We'll assemble it and sell it probably. Now I don't think I've got anything to match those, so we'll just well yeah, we'll just assemble the waiver and sell it. We got all the mech parts, so that's good. Uh, large laser, machine gun. Okay, we got four, that can just go. Small laser, we got a bunch, right? Yeah. SRM six we'll hold on to because we don't have any of those. Armor can go, the 180 core can go. Heat sinks can go. Jump jets can go. Structure can go. All right, so we, I don't know. I don't know if we made any money off this. Ah, 116,000. Damn. Well, I mean, we made an okay amount of money off that. But still, we got to get that. Uh... Ah, it's frustrating. Valkyrie's first, obviously. Avatar's back in one, which is nice. So we could actually start outfitting that, too, if we wanted to. Let's have a look. Um... Actually, let's go ahead and get that repaired now. So, hey boss, we've just completed those. Thank upgrades. you. Uh, Valkyrie's in four, right? So let's go wait. To, let's wait the four. Job's done, Commander. So scooter's down for six. Okay. Um, I don't want to wait, so I'm probably going to swap in pilots. I don't like swapping in pilots. If you guys know me. I kind of like keeping the pilots that are supposed to be. In max in them. Actually, let's let's go to the storage first. I'm gonna get rid of this wavern. I mean, it's not a bad mech. Don't get me wrong, but we have got we got hunchbacks here. We've got the bushwhacker here, right? The wavern's just not gonna get used. I've got the assassin and Clint as backups, so there's no point in keeping this. Let's just ready it and we'll sell it for what we can. That mech is ready to fight, Commander. It's a free assembly. Let's just see what it ended up with. Probably not a lot. Well, it looks like one of the arms is gone, but. We might have get some weapons out of it. Nope. Like, what would we get, if anything? SRM ammo. Wow. That was totally worth it, huh? It's not a bad platform, don't get me wrong. It's not It's not bad for 45 tons, but it's just not going to fit into our play build. 155,000, though. Yeah, that covers our repair costs. We, need, we needed to do that. Alright, let's have a look at the bulk right here. Got to figure out what I'm going to do to this guy. Yeah, damn it. When I position myself, I'm like, yeah, that's right. We're in the we're, we're in the right position. Ah, we lost the uh, zoom too. Shit. All right, with no zoom, then what do we do? We lost the probe king. I can replace that. It's just the chem lasers on the other side. Now, um, what do we want to go with here? Like, I mean, we could put, if I wanted to, like, keep weapon heat down, I could do that. And for some reason it gets rid of the rockets, but that's fine. Um, and then we can look at maybe putting some hotter weapons on. Like, the large chem's three tons. This is two tons, right? So that's five tons. We could technically go with, what do we got for weight here? We got ten tons of weight. Ten and three quarters tons. Oh, man, if I had more weight to spare. How much heat does this put out? 50. Yeah, I can't do it. <laughs> I, I, I don't, I've got a single heat sink kit. i got to be careful of what I put in this thing, right? we got three weapons we can use. Medium max pulse is 20. I mean, we could go with a regular large laser and then try and find, like, SRMs or something, maybe? Yeah, 
You don't have any big rocket packs. We got the streak six. So that's five and a half tons with the ammo. So I would probably put it on this side if I was going to do it. I'm pretty sure we got the streak ammo. We did. So we put it on that side because if the ammo goes off then this thing dies, right? And then maybe we do keep the large chem. The problem is, is that I've only got the double ammo. It's like it's a waste to put that in there almost. Um, got a mag shot. It's like very little damage though. Light machine gun array. 240 meters. Bonus accuracy though. We have to get close. I mean, we could go with a flamer build. But we've already got that in the on the vehicle, right? Light PPC is 15. Like if we drop the chem, go light PPC, and then what? Light PPC. That's only 30 damage though. What's the range on it? 720? Because for two for one ton less, we could go with the medium X pulse. Yeah, it doesn't have the same range, but it has better accuracy. It does have recoil, which not that too concerned about right away. And then we could add a heat sink with it to give the same weight as this to offset the heat. But then we're making another. I mean, I guess we should be making medium, like a medium range build with this thing. What's the heat on this thing? 12. So I have to find something that was pretty cool then. Small laser magna. It's 20 damage. So what are we doing with this? This is 60, 105. Small laser pirate is variable damage. Wait, why is this 12 times three? Alternate fire modes, that's why. Hmm. I know we got the medium improved heavies. Wait, do we have any medium chem ammo? I think we did, didn't we? We have a half load. It's 15 shots. So, I mean, we could go with that and a medium chem. So if we do this, just so that we, we can stay within heat parameters. Medium chem pirate does a little bit more heat. Variable damage is built in. I think it's got built in ammo. It says it carries 10 shots. So I don't know. I'm pretty sure it's built in. This has got variable damage too, but less heat. That gives us two tons left over, which would give us the ability to run the Probe King. What's our heat sinking like? Still really good. So maybe it isn't the medium chem laser then. Or we just downgrade the exchanger. So we're not losing a big one if something happens. Yeah, we could do that. I mean, we could do the recoil mount on this guy, but I think I want to save these. I got to get this into the Centurion somehow. Mm, Probe King is what we had before. Actually, can we get... We could do that. Remax out the armor. Then we have two and a half tons for a one slot item. Or we could take these two out. Hmm. Yeah. 
Yeah, I don't think that's the play. We could go with more heat sinks. Two tons, though. Like, if we go more heat sinks, then we could probably swap out the exchanger. Oh, uh, maybe not. So the pro team adds heat, though, right? Uh, but increases our sensors range. So, uh, do we switch to something else? I mean, we're doing... We're, I mean, this is a quick sell playthrough, right? So we do that, though. Then we got half a ton left over. Yeah, our heat sinking's tanking now. We would have to go back to the... Uh, the other exchanger, I think. And hope we don't lose this mech. That would be the, the big problem. Losing that exchanger. It's a pretty big exchanger for this mech. Although, you know what, though? That being said, that streak's not going to fire every turn. It's just not. We got half a ton left. We do have some space. It's too bad you can't get, like, quarter-ton machine gun ammo. That would be very, very useful, I think. So we don't have any more weapons ports anyway. Not like we could actually add any more weapons. So is there anything internal-wise? I mean, I guess I could put one light jump jet. How much is a coolant flush? One ton. That does no good. Don't want to reduce... I mean, we could go with a speedy leg actuator to get a little bit more walking movement. And then add the rest of the armor again. I guess for now, we do that. I know we got these things. I'm, I'm saving these for the, um, for the avatar. Ooh, we could do an awesome avatar build. We're, we actually have some half east and stuff. Like if I swap out the Centurion for the avatar and we load in the um, rotary on their avatar, like the rack two, the, the pirate rack two and the heavy rotary autocannon or the heavy rotary rifle, it would be a tricky ass build, but I mean, we might be able to do it if we alter the, the turns in which they fire. We might just be able to get away with it. I doubt it, though. Like we'd probably have to fire and then like move to a different position and wait a turn for our our uh, recoil to drop. Yeah, I think this is the route for now. I mean, the heat sinking's like, yeah, it's going to be over if everything fires, but the streaks aren't going to fire all the time, so I'm okay with that. All right, let's try this. I mean, I don't think it has the the punch that the last one had, but we have a little bit better accuracy with the streaks and the X pulse, swapping out for the for the two uh, large chem lasers and the small uh, the mediums back to where it was. So yeah, I'm I'm okay with this. Let's just go with this. Three days. That's not oh. bad. I'll let you know. And I might want to take. Yeah, you're just underweight right now. Um, I might want to take. I mean, we could take this other mission, like not today, but this low-ass mission here with rookie pilots in our advanced lance. Oops, not that one, this one here. Just to see what kind of shit we can get out of it. But I think I would rather take this one. Uh, who is that against? Yeah, the Fife's. Yeah, I mean they don't they're not they don't seem to be packing a relatively heavy punch, so we might be okay. I can, we might even be okay with this one, but this this is like this is a tricky ass mission to take for sure. You never know what you're gonna get. It's an urban environment too. Well you know what? We might actually do well in an urban environment. There's plenty of cover. And if we strip one guy at a time it just depends on how they spawn. Uh, let me think about it. 
Anyway, I'm going to end this episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And please drop your comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later. Oh, my God.